Hi, my name is Anamika Hops, and this is The Art Friend Show, where every conversation focuses on getting to know the essence of creativity itself. I'd love to invite you as well to join me inside of Art Friends School, where we go deeper into these topics and join in with other art friends around the world. Thanks so much for joining us, and let's get to the show. Welcome to the Art Friend Show. Check it out. The show is hung. It's been three hours, and Seth, who curates this space, is a master at hanging, and this is all up. And y'all, this is the first, this is the first time I've had a show since becoming a parent. So it's been, I believe my last show was at Powell's in 2018, September 2018. So this is triumphant. This is the first time I've had an opportunity to show art publicly in like five years, right? Almost four and a half years. I won't get you in the video. You can just go on by. So I just wanted to do a celebratory extra art friend show celebrating that it's all hung. We got all the wall labels on and check out how we did all these little ones down here. They look so good. Check it out. Ta-da! And then over here, look at this. <laughs> There's so many paintings and they're all hung and they all have the labels and they're all done. And we'll be up here for two and a half months and they're all for sale. And it's been really fun while we've been hanging the show. People have been walking by and talking and asking and it's just so thrilling as you, as you might imagine to just see them all dressed up, you know? They're all dressed up and they're done and all the decisions about what to hang. And these changed a lot because um, Seth suggested stacking the smallest ones. And so it all almost became this decision of like the conversation between the ones that are stacked, which is also a fun way to like collect them. Um, but yeah, I'm just so thrilled and feeling <laughs> relieved, triumphant, um, and actually less of that really, I less, less embarrassed than I remember feeling in the past. Um, typically when I would have art shows every single time, and I definitely went through it this morning, I would feel totally embarrassed, like almost wish nobody would come kind of like embarrassed to turn them all around. Um, but here they are. Oh, sorry. Um, here they are. They're all on display and this is the point when, you know, as the artist, it's no longer, it's no longer up to us. This is when our art gets to go do its own work in the world. And my inner critic can take a back seat and let people form their own connections with the work. Um, lots of staff here in the hospital will be walking by all the time. And, you know, maybe it'll be an interesting thing to look at. Maybe not, but whatever. I'm just really grateful to have the opportunity of a show, a real show, a solo show. And I freaking did it, <laughs> which if you know, I mean, everything going on right now with a divorce and everything in life, it's just, it's really celebratory to have a full, a full body of work. 30, 33 paintings I ended up putting in this show, 33 paintings several more in the works still at my house with oil paint on them that's that I just want to keep developing. So these are all the ones that ended up in the show. I'm like a proud clucking chicken, like, yay. And um, I definitely have personal favorites. But like I said, at this point, it's not up to me. It's up to the community that encounters these artworks to form their own opinions to decide to take them into their lives or not, um, to make their own stories about what the imagery means. You know, some people just really are lit up by the color. Suddenly there's just a hallway full of color. Um, other people are really connecting to the imagery. I, it's kind of nice that it's a <laughs> somewhat all over the place uh, collection because it gives people a lot to look at. I also noticed that a lot of kids went like, 
toddling by and wanted to like touch it and talk to it. And I was like, hey, guess what? This one, my three-year-old drew all over it or, you know, kind of showing them those things. So yeah, I'm just really, really excited about this whole body of work. Hooray. Hooray. Yay. <laughs> and I feel honestly, I'm like, all right, now I want to just start the next show. Like, where's my next venue? I want to keep going. Um, really excited, motivated. Um, yeah, going to get some good rest tonight. It's been a big, big week. It's my daughter's birthday and launching Art Friends School. Definitely join Art Friends School. Come learn with me. It's going to be a blast. Meanwhile, so excited um, installing this show. And ta -da! we're done. Yay. I'd love to have you inside of Art Friends School, where we go deeper into these topics. Follow the link that's in the show notes or find it on my website at onamika.com.